SNN Weather First with meteorologist Joshua Rebus. All right, and good Thursday afternoon, everybody. Hope you're enjoying your Thursday. It's time for a quick web weather update here. Look at the tropics to start out, and we do have uh, Henri uh, just to the east of Bermuda there, but it's kind of hard to locate because, again, pretty disorganized with most of the convection off to the east. But here is Henri spinning out here. Uh, but anything left of Henri is heading out towards the north and northeast away from us, so no worries there in the tropics. Headlines, slightly drier rest of Thursday going into Friday, mainly early. Chances of rain will slightly increase late Friday. I think the best chance of rain will be Saturday as a frontal boundary moves in our general direction. And that frontal boundary is pretty strong, bringing, bringing some seasonably to unseasonably cool air just to our north. Here's a look at it in the terms of humidity in the mid levels of the atmosphere. Here's the front Friday, Saturday. Here it comes. It's coming down pretty strong as well. Oh man, right there near the Florida Panhandle border. Again, a lot. Look how comfortable this air is. Very dry air coming down in parts of the Tennessee Valley. So near unseasonably cool air lows in the 40s. Yeah, pretty uh, cool up there, uh, but very comfortable. Hopefully, fingers crossed, that portions of Tampa Bay and parts of the Sun Coast will get some drier air late Sunday and Monday, but it is a stretch. And here's why in the upper levels, most of the energy begins to lift out very quickly. You can see it right here. Here's the dip coming down, but see how it kind of lifts out just a little bit by the end of the run here, uh, lifting out. So again, because it's tilted in this direction and it's lifting out pretty quickly, it's going to be a stretch to see if we get any dry air at all. Rest of today, here's a look at the setup. High pressure near the surface and aloft, so it kind of sinks the air a little bit, lowering those rain chances. Best chance of rain will be in the inland spots. Rest of today, 89 degrees here in Sarasota with an isolated storm possible. Inland spots near 93, 95 degrees with the scattered storms throughout the afternoon and the evening hours. For tonight, it's going to be muggy. 78 degrees to near 80 degrees near the coast and even mid-70s uh, in the spots. Here's the pollen forecast. Well, going with the next three days. Again, watching the front uh, going sat, uh, Sunday, mainly Saturday into Sunday. Uh, but that's your pollen forecast the next three days. Seven-day forecast. 30% the rest of today. I'm going 40% on Friday, 60% on Saturday. I think it's going to be mainly going to be cloudy on Sunday. We'll watch it closely, but right now we'll stick around 40% chance of rain. All right, that's it for now. We have another web weather update coming up later today and tomorrow.